Jenkins. That's not what I meant. I came here to... Congratulations, Libby. It's all yours. Resign. Hello? Hi, Mom. So glad you're home. We missed you. Not going to change. You don't snap your fingers and it disappears. You don't buy a ticket and it goes away. It's here. Now. Look at me. No. Look at me. You want to make magic happen? Go ahead. Make it happen. I can't. Hello? Oh, Mom, I can hear you come in. I guess not. Um, this is Jesse McKenna. We were just rehearsing the scene for drama class. Sounds pretty heavy. Well, it's about cancer patients coming to terms with their own death. It's great. Well, couldn't you just do something from our town? Mom, it's not exactly cutting edge. Best Whoa. ever, Liv. Oh, no, no, no. You can never have enough chicken Giordano. <laughs> Here, have some more. I made it myself. Oh, yeah, you took the wrapper off and heated it. Well, what did you do? I made the salad. Everything is delicious. <laughs> well, you're catching on to that, you're women pretty fast. Oh, Drew. Pasta pepper? So, how do you like it here in Glenbrook? It's okay. Just okay? Well, I'm still trying to adjust speeds. Jesse says he's learning the same things now that they taught him last year at a school in Pennsylvania. <laughs> Mrs. Thatcher, can I try? I've always had this magic touch with my little brother. Sure, go ahead. Thank you. Mm -hmm. It's okay. It's You wouldn't happen to have any older brothers, would you? Nick likes Tyler the best. Uh, Aunt Benchfield's a good guy. Tyler taught Becca to drive. That's right, he did. And he's the best athlete in school. He lettered in four sports. And he's really a great friend. Well, why don't we just canonize him? <laughs> to Tyler. <laughs> to Tyler. He's a lucky guy. Hey, uh, isn't that my great-granddad's glass? Well, maybe if somebody ran the dishwasher today, I could have given him a regular one. Well, I, I, I can use something else. No, 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 that's okay. It's just a little something I saved over the years from his old restaurant. It's just a memory. Oh, it's beautiful. No, I wouldn't go that far. It's had some sentimental value. No, I mean, it's beautiful to be remembered like that after you're gone. You know, I haven't had a dinner like that in a long time. So you said you had brothers? Yeah. Yeah, but we don't get together much these days. Well, who exactly do you get together with? What do you mean? I know you don't hang out with anyone from school, so you must have other friends. Not quite. Well, if you don't have friends, then what do you do? I read and... I think. About what? About stuff. Like what kind of stuff? You don't want to know. Yes, I do. No, you don't. So do you miss Philadelphia? Mm, parts of it, yeah. Did you have a girlfriend there? <laughs> That's a very interesting question coming from a girl who's going with a saint. So did you? What if I said yes? And that I'm still totally in love with her? Would you be disappointed? Maybe. Well, you know... <laughs> Why did you do that? Why? I don't know. All my life, I've been in love with Tyler, and then I spend the day with you, and I'm feeling all these new things. I thought you felt them, too. <sighs> Jesse, what are you doing? You can't just leave. Watch me. Jesse, wait. I have to know how you feel about me. The world doesn't revolve around you, Becca. I never said it did. What do you want? You want me to kiss you again? Is that what you want? 
but I can't. But why? I don't understand. Then just leave it alone. Jesse, what is it? Am I not pretty enough for you? I'm not cool enough? I'm There's not smart enough? There's nothing wrong with you, Becca. Then what? Then nothing. Just go home. Jesse, what are you so afraid of? I am not afraid of anything. Then why are you running away? Look, let's just pretend that this whole day never happened, okay? But why? I don't understand. You're not giving me a reason. Jesse, you're not telling me everything, and that's not fair. Fair? Do you want to hear fair? I'm HIV positive. How's that for fair? What? Becca, I'm going to get AIDS.